Um, I just want to start by saying that you, I guess, missed the point of our plan, which is that not putting one building just for all of like Philadelphia, there's going to be a whole bunch in the areas that need it. That's the point of it, is that we're making it more accessible. <coughs> and um, also TANF, the whole point of TANF is that there's a limited amount of time that you're on the system and that you have to get a job. That's what TANF is, and that's why we're putting people on it, because you are forced to get a job or else you lose benefits. Um, the whole thing with the democracy and how it's going to make everybody socialist, I'm not totally sure about that, just because um, we're giving people benefits, which is making them get jobs, which then means that they're going to be paying taxes and then contributing back to the programs. So it's all working in a giant circle, and it's all coming back to, to, like, to itself, and that makes sense. And also, you said $12 trillion that we're in debt. I'm not sure what you mean by $58 like, trillion. Um, also, people in poverty, they're Americans too. So when they end up getting jobs, then they'll be paying taxes, and then they'll be contributing back. Um, also, um, the reason that we're increasing the programs that we have, we're not, like, they're not working now because no one's, no one understands how to get on them and how to use them and utilize them for what they are, and that's what our plan is for, to get them to understand the programs and to put them on them so that they are receiving the benefits. And by doing that, then the programs will end up working. And you can't say that they're not going to end up working just because they're failing right now. And also, Clinton's plan is completely different from ours. They're just, they're, they're just different. Like, his, his didn't Im involve using welfare. Like, ours is involving the welfare plan. We're not changing welfare. We're still using welfare. Um, our plan is to change how people get out of poverty in a way that benefits everyone involved. By getting more people on welfare and on TANF, more kids in Head Start, and more people on SNAP, we're boosting the economy, because those people will then go out and contribute right back. We need to change our current system, and our plan does that and more. With the rise in poverty and unemployment, we need a substantial increase in social services to keep up with the substantial rise in unemployment and poverty. So vote to end poverty. Vote for it.